Hey everybody, this is Glidercat, and it's time to play. We're back in Captain of Industry, Insula Mortis Season 6. This is our second bite of the apple here on the Insula Mortis map. Trying to conquer it. The map has changed. There's some new deposits, and things are a little different, but it's mostly the same. We've got a gold tooth here, which I think is hilarious. Uh, but let's get back to where we were. I'm going to hit play single speed here. We're waiting to store wood. Currently, a lot of our wood looks like it's going into construction part one construction. But let's, uh, on the storage here, we may need to do a little bit of a keep full here uh, to trigger our trucks to supply wood there. Our tree cutter is clearing out farmland for us right now, actually. So we'll probably want to plunk down another farm over here. Once this area is cleared out, we can see the tree designations. I guess we should take out these last little two in that clump. Maybe those two, and maybe that one. And that'll free up some space for us, and we can get another farm done. Food right now is looking good. It's actually climbing. We're at 57 months. We've got 11 free workers. Unity is climbing. Our Unity cap is at 36. So. We're kind of wasting Unity. Is there a way, is there anything I can use Unity for right now? Can I boost already? Boost. Let's boost something. Let's boost. Yeah, let's boost mechanical parts. I wonder if I should set up storage. I don't think I can boost research, no. We have this extra unity. I don't want to just kind of waste it. I think you stop accruing it once you hit the cap. What else? I can't boost farms. That would be nice. All right. Wood is now getting stored. We have 20 out of 40 that we need for the little objective. Kick that up a little bit. What's next? I kind of want to get to... Starting on our mining operation over here. Let's see what that's going to involve. We can just kind of jump the gun here and do a little bit. We're going to need a mine control tower. Know that. Uh, let's look at the overlay. Okay, we're going to want to dig, dig on into this. I also want to experiment with retaining walls this time too more see if we can get better at using those leveraging those um uh my control tower iron doesn't matter right there is fine uh let's edit the area to this i have no excavators we're going to need to get a vehicle depot going right there's Vehicle Depot. Takes 40 construction parts. We're making a ton of these. Where do we want the Vehicle Depot? Somewhere out of the way. Might make some sense. Um, let's do it. Can I wiggle it in here? Is there a little bit of room between these trees anywhere? Might be a little tight. Uh, boy, space early on is always a challenge. That'll do. That'll do for now. Let's queue up an excavator. I think we can queue things up even before we're ready. And two trucks. We're going to need vehicle parts. And I think we're going to need... Do not need rubber? Yeah, rubber too. Oh, man. But we'll get that queued up so then we can start doing mining. Okay, purchase bricks or wood from the village. Okay, they want us to test out trading. We'll do it. Um, bricks for wood. Zoom that in a bit. Bricks for wood right there. Boom. Okay. That, yep. Okay, we satisfied that objective. We'll get 40 bonus bricks and 40 construction parts. We'll take it. Construct a small excavator. We already have that going. Pickups times two. We got that going too already. That's pretty funny. Uh, build a mine control tower near the iron ore deposit. That's underway already as well. 
and then we'll assign the excavator and the pickups once those are built. So that's all happening. Enable the iron recipe that uses iron ore at the blast furnace. We can do that. Boom and boom for both of those. We are now going to get slag that we have to deal with. Okay, process iron ore. Okay, we got to wait till we get all of our excavators and stuff built. Oh man, that vehicle depot built pretty quick. All right, what else? Build a beacon. Build a beacon, build a beacon. Beacon can kind of be out of the way somewhere too, I think. Um, where might you be? Buildings. How about right there? There's our beacon. Build housing attached to the existing settlement. Okay, they want one more housing unit. Show us how to do that. Housing right there, boom. Boom. I don't know if we have to move these rocks. I think we might. Let's see. Is it going to complain? Um, I can't tell what color that is. Looks like it would take it. So maybe the rocks aren't going to be a problem. I think they do impede the trucking routes. Unity is still way in the positive. I wish I had a way to burn through that faster. Um, maybe if I get storage set up for construction part ones, where would we might want to do that? Construction part ones are going to be coming out of here. We'll probably have storage. Unit storage. Um, yeah, it's just hard to know exactly. How we're going to lay all this stuff out yet. I'm gonna put a unit storage here just for construction parts. You know, I could, I guess I could boost all of this. That's backed up too. I'm just looking at our objectives here. Basic diesel is now researched. Okay, build housing. Okay, wait for the first refugees to arrive. So the beacon is working. Expect 14 refugees in less than three months. Okay, we'll let that run. Uh, that's chewing up a little unity, isn't it? Yeah, one unity. Now we're only at 0.05 positive unity. How's wood looking? Okay, I wonder if I should just ramp this thing up to say keep full. It looks like it is filling past the limit. Uh, we're going to want to get rid of burning wood for coal, too, eventually. Okay, bricks production's underway. Not much for us to do at the moment. We don't have belts and things. Ooh! Hey, we got our excavator. Let's get that assigned. Boom. And then we'll assign a couple trucks. And then we need the mining designation. I haven't done that yet. Mining designation. Let's go flat to start. Look at our layers. Let's flatten this area out first. We can get some. I guess we'll flatten it to level three. We can get this iron here. Boom. Boom. And then we'll worry about digging a little bit later. There goes our first excavator. Um, do we have loose storage? We don't. We have fluid storage. Do I have a way to collect water? Doesn't look like it yet. We have oil pumps. We could get that going. Think about diesel production. Let's take a look at the overlay again. But this area is where we're going to want to do our diesel. Those trees aren't really in our way yet. OK, 
Okay, oil pumps. 18 every 60 seconds. And then our distiller is going to take oil plus coal. Coal we're getting from the coal burner. We could think about setting up a coal mine. I think we'll rely on the burner right now, though. Um, until we can actually produce diesel. Oh, this is going to get us wastewater and exhaust. 54. So what is that? Three of these? Three oil pumps I think we're going to eventually want here. Let's um, lock these guys down. Start getting that built. Okay, we have the first refugees. I'm going to turn off the beacon. Um, just to conserve food. We'll see. I'll probably toggle this on and off quite a bit. Don't want to end up with more workers than I have jobs for. I'll collect this bonus that gets us 40 potatoes and 20 vehicle parts. Okay, we're waiting on another pickup truck. I might need to queue one up. Let's see. Nope, there's one already being queued up. Hmm. Um, vehicle parts, I have 80 left. I'm going to go a little conservative till I'm producing vehicle parts on my own. Right now we're just relying on bonuses and things. There's construction parts. Let's put that on. Keep full. And then let's throw a boost on one of these. Basically just to use up unity. This is full so I can take off the boost. But these aren't. Let's boost all three of these. Basically doing that just to burn through the surplus unity. Okay, ore mining. We've mined our first ore. Awesome. Oh yeah, trucks can carry mixed load, mixed materials. Check it out. Iron ore, rock, and dirt. We'll have to observe and see just how that is going to work. But maybe this truck is going to make a couple trips. Let's just watch it. I know I got all this stuff up on the screen, but I kind of want to see what happens here. He's going to dump off the iron. Now he's got rock and dirt. And our only fill designations over here. Oh, look at the trash. Gross. All right. Like it. Uh, let's get rid of that. Let's collect the bonus. And let's do let's do something here. Smart. I'm thinking I want to fill designation here, like specifically for rock and dirt. And then hopefully our truck won't have to go across the island to this dump designation dump everything. So let's try that. Let's go to do a fill designation. Um, yeah, let's take a look at this. This is a fill designation. And I want... What I, ideally, what I want to do is have up to level two, two above sea level, be rock. And then anything above, and it could be trash or anything else. But then the top layer, from level two to level three, I would like that to be soil. So how might we think about achieving that? That's going to go down to two above. Let's, I'm going to peel this one layer back. I'm just hitting the rotate key here. Don't want to go up. I want to go down. Kind of want... Um, let's see. 
Bear with me. I want to make sure the edge is at three, I think. Three above sea level. Yeah, so that's three above sea level. If we were to do this. That gives me an edge three above sea level. I would like that to all be dirt, I guess. And then once we get over here and we start going down, then I can do rock and whatever else. Right? So I'm going to pause for a second. I know this is a little wonky. But let's see if we can get this going from the start. Um, get these fill designations the way we want them from the start. All right, you... Cover this area. And you're only going to allow dirt. And then the rest can be whatever. They can dump rock. They can dump anything else. But we're going to have to bridge over to that before that works. I think that's what I want. And then I may want to quick build this. Boom. Hit clay. And we can call this... Um, Iron, mine, fill, power, one. <laughs> so basically just labeling this mine control tower to indicate that it's, it's just for designating where we can dump materials. And I just want to limit that to being dirt. I want the top layer of the entire island to be dirt. I like the way that looks. Grass can grow on it. We can plant farms on it. If we want to. All right, let's keep moving. We've got plenty of construction part ones. That's all looking good. Our oil rigs are ready for us to do something with. We've got new refugees. We never did claim our bonus for this. 34 copper, rubber, a little bit of scrap and some diesel. We'll take it. Bricks production has been researched. I may pause here. Um, processing ore dump slag. Okay, that should dump on its own. Flag is going to come out of these two. Don't think, do I have loose storage? Nope, not yet. Eventually we'll belt out that slag. Ooh, I hope I can. Let's make sure I can. Um, I don't have U-shaped conveyors yet, so I can't tell if I can actually belt out of there or not. It's pretty close. We'll see. We should be able to make that work. If not, we can always move these back up a block. All right, build an oil pump, three or two on an oil deposit, connecting the basic distiller, liquid dump. All right, let's get the basic distiller going. We'll do the oil production. This guy allows distillation of low grade diesel, but it is quite inefficient and produces a lot of waste. I wouldn't mind two of these things, but all right, we need to get material in and then a bunch of material out. So how about you like that? And let's connect up these guys. I think we can go right up next to them, can we not? I thought there was a way to do that. Um, if not, we can just do it like this. Hey, no recipes to set here, I don't imagine. In it comes, we've got stinky exhaust. Let's get rid of that with the smokestack here. Make sure that's piped together. Uh, not like that. Uh, it looks pretty, but I think we just need a small section. Okay, we do have fluid storage. And we have diesel generator. We wouldn't mind routing fuel to as well. 
So what could we do smart? Um, thinking, thinking, kind of picturing, um, a small array of these diesel generators. So how about tank like that? I guess we can come up high. And come down low. Oh, 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 vertical pipes are pretty cool. I did not see even appreciate the significance of that feature when I saw it in the release notes. That is going to be sweet. Uh, let's see if we can pull that off. Clever, bear with me with my camera skills here. Thinking about pillars right now where the pillars are going to go. I'm trying to inch my way close. Looks like I have to put here. Um, let me hit unsnap the R key. Can I get any closer? Nope. It wants to do crazy things. That'll do. And now I'm going to put snap back on. Ideally, I would come right over here and then go down. Can I do that? Man, look at that. That's awesome. Oh, man, I'm pretty happy. Pretty happy with that feature. Okay, let's um set that to diesel. We're on pause, so I can babble all I want here without too much worry. And now the wastewater we have to dump, unfortunately, early on. Um, I don't think I've got a way to process that. But we're going to have to do that before long because, man, pollution is going to stifle our colony. I'll build this right on the edge. And then this pipe, I think, can just stay on the ground, maybe? I mean, I guess we could try and go up with it. I guess there's no reason not to, right? Stay high. And maybe do something like that. A little goofy. But I like it. I like it. Quite a bit. Quite a bit. Do I have to pick a recipe for this? I do. All right, we should be good. This is going to dump out 12 per minute. This guy will take up to 60 a minute. We've got three oil rigs doing 18 each. So what is that? Um, what is that? 54. And then this guy is going to take 54 oil. And we've got our exhaust handled. We've got storage for diesel. Thinking of, um, is this just construction parts? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Ooh. What I wanted to do, show you, I wanted to put another diesel generator here. And run this pipe. Kind of like that. So maybe, but I also want more, more storage. So maybe, maybe, where could we put that? And potentially another distiller and another row of these guys. Could do something goofy like that. Eventually we need a fuel depot um, so we can refill our refuel our excavators and stuff, a fuel station. Um, this is kind of goofy. 
tempted to do it just for fun. Again, right now I'm just thinking about storage for fuel so we can store up a fair amount of diesel and just visually be able to look over here and see how we're doing on diesel. Maybe just curious. Can I connect this up nice and cool looking with the new vertical pipes? Uh, maybe I can go the other direction. I don't want that. You know what I'm saying? Straight up. Looks like it might not. It might want to do a loop or something. Uh, it's not horrible. Not beautiful, but it's not horrible. Um, R. Yeah, that doesn't help. I'm going to go with that, actually. And then we'll set this to fuel. Let's hit play. That is diesel production and a backup diesel generator and waste exhaust. All that's good. What are we doing on Unity is still too high, higher than I want it. Producing construction parts. We have tons of construction part ones. We need to build, build, build. Oh, maintenance. Maintenance is at 100. A dump slag, that will happen on its own. Should happen on its own. I can't dump this slag into storage. Trucks can get there and empty that out, I believe. Eventually, we want loose storage. We still don't have that yet. Unit storage and assign it iron. Okay, they want us to store iron plates somewhere. We do that really anywhere. What about what about right here? If we had a backup storage of iron, make this iron plates. And then we can belt this off, have some of it go into storage, and have the rest of it go into this array. Oh, man. Been waiting on conveyors. It's going to be a while. I'm slag. Okay, build the oil pumps. Distiller. Liquid dump. We've done it. Produce diesel. It's on its way. Dump the wastewater. That's all on autopilot. Build unit storage and assign it iron. We've done it. Kind of. Trees, we could get another farm going. How are we doing on workers? 14. Um, okay, 0.9 months. Crop will survive up to three months. 0.2. Do we have storage for food? That has storage for 400 food. Let's get another farm going. We know we're going to need it. Hard to tell if these are exactly lined up. Good enough for me. We'll get that going. What is that? 30 more construction parts. We've got plenty. I feel like I should be building more. What about these? Where are those going? It's all going to be for construction part level ones. Ship dock repair is done. Dismiss. I think that might be worth getting going. If it is just iron plates for this. Repair. Construction parts. All for it. Go for it. Go for it.
are we doing on vehicle parts? 80. Diesel. We just had 293. Okay, what's going on here? I don't see things pumping. Okay, waiting for products. Coal. We might need another coal burner. We could start mining this coal, but man, that's a long drive to deliver that coal. What about, hmm, how's this guy doing? Waiting for products, waiting for wood. Might want another tree harvester. Not crazy about doing that. Let's look at the marked trees. Where might our tree harvester be? Over this way, looks like. I see. We need to do brick production. That's a thing. We should be thinking about. Oh. Looks like this guy needs another truck, right? He's waiting for trucks. Let's, um... Give him one more truck, and then let's uh, build one more truck. Kind of want to do that sparingly. We have five free workers. That's it. We might want to turn on the beacon one time. Let's do it. All right. We did our iron unit storage, so let's get our bonus. 20 electronics. That'll help. Slag. Yep. Yep, that's all on autopilot. Hopefully that extra truck will help the wood production move forward a little faster. Looks like maybe not. Where are you guys? Yeah, they just they have a lot of driving to do. That's slowing down our wood production. Diesel generators firing. We're starting to produce diesel fuel. That's slowly, slowly climbing. We'll keep an eye on that. Pretty close eye on that. 232. Coal is our kind of our issue. Iron, he needs trucks as well. Uh, no, he doesn't. Trucks full of iron ore, they don't have anywhere to take it. Why not? Because... Yes, the incoming inventory is full. Waiting for products. Coal. Yeah, coal is a problem right now. Do we mine it? And burn through a bunch of diesel to deliver it? Or do we get another tree harvester and kind of accelerate clearing out all these trees? Um, eventually, we're going to have issues. We're going to run out of wood. And we're going to need to replant wood. So there used to be a sawmill out on the map here where we could um, import wood. That is no longer part of the game from what I understand. Assembly manual has no recipe selected. Let's go. You guys can keep busy doing that. I'll give you boost too. Okay, now we're short workers. So we have the beacon on. Two months, we'll get 14 refugees and some little bonus products, most likely. Burning through our backlog of construction parts, which is fine by me. Diesel's at 217. Coal is our issue. We know we're going to have to start mining this coal. We could start preparing for that. Let's take a look at the design or at the um the overlay. Hmm. A bunch of coal. Oh man. How to tackle that? 
How do we want to go about doing it? Let's, um... Let's plan to do it. Let's get at least one more excavator built. We'll get that queued up. Um, it's going to eat up a lot of our vehicle parts, but I'm going to do it. And then we're going to need mind control tower. And then a dump designation. Mind control tower somewhere here. Put it a little bit away from where the ore actually is. So that it doesn't collapse when we um when we start mining, digging down. I'll put it there. Let's edit the area to be over here. We'll start, I guess, the same kind of way. We'll just level this area out. Let's do a mining designation, flat. Um, we're level three, level three. Oh man, this is different. I think this used to be up at level five. Where am I thinking of over here? Ooh, level 10. Um, level 10 there, level three here, huh? All right. So yeah, let's get a level three, flatten this all out. These are kind of outside the mining designation area, but that's fine. And then we can assign an excavator once it's built. Trucks. 15. How many trucks are free? Six. Oh, it's not great. Let's queue up a truck as well. Um, trucking on the island is very busy. Not terribly surprising. These oil thing or these uh diesels look like they're filling up. Happy to see that. Coal is our big problem right now. Burner is waiting on fuel, although he's making some now. Probably need a second one. We need to mine this dirt here too. Oh man. Okay, new refugees have arrived. Hooray, we'll take them. It's us nine free workers. I think we'll go one more batch. One more batch of workers. Copper refinement is unlocked. That's gonna help us with the electronics. Do we have rubber? I don't think we do. Oh, we have rainwater harvesters now. Hmm. Let's take wood. Uh, let's take a look at the tech tree. Curious about irrigated farms. There's settlement water. That's Maybe our first opportunity. Oh, irrigated farms right there. Groundwater pump, irrigated farms. Do we want to start collecting water? And if so, where? I feel like this has to be level two. Yeah, lots to think about. Kind of thinking brick production is going to be important. Do we have the ability to do that? Brickworks takes dirt, hole, water, gets us bricks and some exhaust. Be a good way for us to start using up the uh, dirt. Hey, okay, there's our excavator. Let's see if we can speed this up. Do I have construction parts? I do. Now let's build that. Assign an excavator and two trucks to start. 
and we'll get a little bit of coal mining going. I'm not sure if that's the wisest choice, just because it's far from where we're using the coal. It is going to result in us burning up more diesel. We may, like I said, need to double this up. And I like more storage for this too, to be honest. That guy needs coal. Yeah, we need lots of coal. All right, diesel production. That objective's met. We get 20 bonus construction parts and 50 bricks. Slag has not been dumped yet. Why? Do you have slag? You do. And you have slag as well. Iron parts. Coal, right? These guys are waiting on coal. Yeah, coal is our issue. Tell you what, let's wrap this episode here. Hey, we got some iron scrap and rubber. Ooh, that's handy. All this stuff is really handy, actually. Hooray, we have 23 extra workers. I'm going to go ahead and pause the beacon. Yeah, let's... Oh, we got another thing to collect here. We dumped our slag finally. 40 extra diesel and 40 vehicle parts. Vehicle parts, yes. That is useful to us. Yeah, let's wrap this episode here. I think what we need to do next episode is get on the um, bricks. Brick production. Because we're going to run into problems getting construction materials uh, if we don't get that get that brickworks going. I'm going to take coal dirt... And then once we get that going, maybe we can start kind of chewing up this top lumpy layer off over here. Oh, yeah, and we have copper over this way now. Hmm. Forget about that. Didn't have this last playthrough. This is a new deposit. That might help us with our, our electronics production that we're going to need for maintenance. And then, yeah, I was looking for rubber, too. We have that yet? Yeah, rubber maker. Oh man, so much to do as always. But yeah, well, in fact, the research just got done on rubber. Awesome, awesome. Love it. All right, that's it for this episode. Thanks so much for watching. Special thanks to Glattercat patrons and channel members whose contributions to the channel make this content possible. Uh, there's links in the description if you'd like to help support the channel. I would deeply appreciate it. And I'll see you guys all in the next episode.